The EnviroLink system is really quite intuitive. It's a touch screen that allows you to enable whichever environmental feature you like. Top left we have heater and fan. There's lighting, auxiliary, sound, and in the bottom right corner you'll notice that there's this green lift symbol. Now if that's not there, that means that the lift cable has not been plugged in. It's just connected on one end or the other. When you're inside of a screen, you can hit this return symbol to go back to the home page and hitting the moon symbol puts it to sleep. This is the low energy mode. To wake up the EnviroLink, touch anywhere on the logo and return to the home screen. Going into the heater, we can turn the heat up to 100% and down again in degrees of 10. This will turn the heater on or off for a certain amount of time. Fans are controlled similarly by touching up. We can control the amount of air flowing out of the fans. Lighting, 10 volt or 12 volt. 10 volt is the control that we were talking about earlier. It's used by Trillium, Cree, and others that have electronic ballasts. The 12 volt is your concept lights like Mosso, Z-Bar, any of those special 12 volt lights. This is where we can control them from. And down again in steps of 10%. Over here we have the auxiliary port. If we had anything plugged into it, like an external light fixture or something, we can turn it on or off. Sound. This is only going to be heard if you have external powered speakers plugged into the EnviroLink system. That's the port on the far right of the back of the ECM. We do have a white noise generator that can be chosen. That's the button on the left. If you turn around on the back, there's an audio input, which can be controlled by selecting audio and increasing the sound volume here. And that will play through the powered speakers. The Linac lift control is the green button in the bottom right corner. When activated, you can choose between front or rear lift columns if you have both. And they can press and hold to lift or lower, just like the puck. You can use either control, they do the same thing. Another great feature of the Linac lift control on the EnviroLink is, is on-screen air detection. If you hit the info button, it'll give you more information about what's wrong. In this case, we have channel one's cable is disconnected. Let's reconnect it and then lower the console to reset the error. Notice that we can only lower and not raise. Remember during error one, no impact detection system will be working. Make sure nothing is in the way. And now we can resume up motion, error is cleared. On the back of the touchscreen, there's two ports, one for audio in and another for USB. You can plug in any phone or tablet to receive a charge. 